That was a long shot. It looks like it got shot on him. But it was a long shot in the wind. Chad's gonna try and put a finishing shot on him here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I got him. I got him. You down. There he goes. Down. Down. Woo, nice shooting, Chad. Woo. Nice shooting, buddy. That worked great. Well, they could have come a little closer. It could have been a little closer. <laughs> How long was that shot? 84. 84. 84. Nice going. That's 72 to finish them. 84 and 72. Ooh. Nice shooting. Congratulations. Thank you. Good deal. That was, and that was the best one of the group, too. It was. Yep. Yep. I was just waiting for him to turn sideways. Yeah. Know? And it's like every time I'd go, it's like then he'd turn and walk away a little bit. It was like, and then turn back around. Either head on or back and forth. The other two were sideways, but as long as I'm going to shoot one, I might as well go. You might as well go for the big might one. Go for the biggest exactly. one. Exactly. All right. So. Congratulations, Chad. Good, good goat. Good heavy goat. Last day of September in 2017, and yep. I think you might have just put the last punch on our antelope hunting for the year. Yeah. Great, great goat, and just he didn't play the game right, but he just. Walked a little bit too close. We tried to decoy him first and he just stared us down and didn't want to come to the decoy. Just kept walking down the drainage and we kind of just kept an eye on him and eventually he joined up with two other smaller goats and they started, kept walking down the drainage and Chad was able to slide in on a little side gully and get halfway close to him. And yeah, they were gonna walk away. It was shooting now or they were gonna be gone, so. Yep, so. 84 on the initial hit and 72 on the killing shot, yeah. but not not too bad shooting there, Chad. Yeah. Yes, sir.